so in the previous video we have seen how to use them so whenever you open or whenever you are downloading a software a window will pop up asking you the path in your system so how to do it in our using the GUI programming using tinker we will be seeing it now so for that let us create one more button and let us say it open file and let me change this command to m file open and pack now let us create a method for this define m file open and now let us a file one is equal to file dialog dot ask file open so what this will do this will ask you to open the file and store it in the variable file one now let us execute this code first see here this is what we have created a open file as soon as we click it so it is showing the error so let us see what the error is so here the method name is not ask file open ask open file now let us save it and execute it so now when we are pressing on the open file see this window is getting popped now we can select any file and open it or we can select the path where the file should download so let me select one file so nothing happens because we haven't written enough code so now once we selected a file the cell file path is stored in this file one so let us see the output what does it contains so for that let us create one more label like this and paste it is equal to text and change it here text is, is equal to get it from the file one okay now let us see the output click on the open file choose any file see here now file one contains the file path of that and mode is equal to read now you can read that file so once you got it inside the variable it's your wish what you should want you should do with that path inside the variable that's up to the requirement whether you should want to write a file or open a file just for a read that's up to you when you once you get the file path into inside the file one so the next operation can be performed hope you understood how to get the file using this file dialog dot ask open file method keep practicing meet in the next video